Welcome back to Tips Farm. Uh, it's gonna be a short one. Um, I'm just out here in the guilt pen trying to clear things up. All right, so there's a lot of leaf litter down. There's also a bunch of sticks and branches and whatnot. And basically what I'm doing is I'm uh, breaking everything into piles and then tried burning just in the pile but this, these leaves don't want to burn so I brought the uh, burn barrel in the pen with me I have to uh, load up you know sticks and branches and whatnot let the fire get going and then smother the fire with leaves until you know there's no more flames then I load more logs up and whenever I start getting flames again smother it back down unfortunately it's now getting above the rim so it's becoming much slower so this pile was oh probably about that big uh, somewhere in there so yeah I also went and took from this pile too but it's insane but the real thing I actually just wanted to go and get some more footage of the baby goat Me. he does not have a name yet I am thinking chomper maybe you know dad's name is nibbler You can see Kimber in the background. Come here, come here, baby goat. Ooh, was that too big? Too big of a step? Yeah. It's a cute little guy. So, did end up wearing him uh, after I went, uh, I guess, went off. Of being live on uh, whatever the, the 15th uh, came in at 7.09 pounds um, however many kilograms that is uh, yeah so not a ginormous little guy not a itty bitty little thing you know average and for it being Kimber's very first uh, pregnancy it's not bad um, this does prove that uh, even though nibbler does have a uh, undescended uh, testicle he is uh, he is in fact fertile oh we had a bunch of rain the other day I don't know if anyone watched the uh, the live feed but uh, the water was all the way up to here and went all the way back to there. You can almost make out where ugh, the stream is supposed to be. It's still eh, a little soggy still. You know, water level may have actually been above my, like, uh, bottom part of my thigh at some parts of down here. But, uh, yeah, here's, here's a stream and it's, um, oversized from what it normally is. It's usually only this area right here. So, it's still wide. I don't know how well these leaves are coming up is showing the amount of water that was here. I couldn't see past this green waxy leaf stuff. 
Uh, yep, definitely flooding. Um, yeah, it definitely looks like it continued on back through all this waxy leaf stuff. Um, hopefully this summer I can get this stuff cleared. Yeah, hopefully we can go and get a somewhat dry summer so I can bring the tractor down here and uh, start doing some cleaning. Baby goat is <laughs> trying to see what is edible or not. I don't know if you're supposed to be eating such a young age, little one. Can't burr. Hey, little baby goat. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah, I figure, uh, probably a good idea to, uh, you know, get the little baby goat used to me at a nice early age so that we don't have a, another baby, baby Hamilton on our hands. A little wild child. So I, I try to come out here couple times a day and uh you know let the baby goat acclimize itself to me and that way you know much easier to handle whenever he becomes a little older and you know big old horns like daddy all right well it looks like it's about time for me to go on toss some more leaves onto this uh, fire and then start getting more sticks ready. As always, have a great day.